Valentina Tereshkova, cosmonaut and first woman in space. Valentina Tereshkova was the first woman to go into space. In 1963, she spent almost three days in space and orbited the Earth 48 times in her space capsule, Vostok 6. That was her only trip to space. Tereshkova later toured the world to promote Soviet science and became involved in Soviet politics. Valentina was born on March 6, 1937, in Maslanikovo, a village near the Volga River, 170 miles northeast of Moscow. Her parents worked on a collective farm and her father was killed during World War II. Valentina left school when she was 16 and worked at a textile factory, but continued her education through correspondence courses according to the Smithsonian Air and Space Museum. Valentina joined the factory's Young Communist League and soon advanced to the Communist Party. She became interested in parachute jumping after joining the Yaroslav Air Sports Club. After Yuri Gagarin became the first man in space in 1961, Valentina volunteered for the Soviet space program. Although she did not have any experience as a pilot, she was accepted into the program because of her 126 parachute jumps. At the time, cosmonauts had to parachute from their capsules seconds before they hit the ground upon returning to Earth. Along with four other women, Valentina received 18 months of training, which included tests to determine how she would react to long periods of time by being alone, to extreme gravity conditions, and zero gravity conditions. Of the five women, only Valentina went into space. Valentina logged more than 70 hours in space and made 48 orbits of Earth. Soviet and European TV viewers saw her smiling face and her logbook floating in front of her. They did not realize that the flight almost turned into tragedy, a fact that was classified for about 40 years. She landed in the Altai region near today's Kazakhstan-Mongolia-China border. Villagers helped Valentina out of her spacesuit and asked her to join them for dinner. She accepted and was later reprimanded for violating the rules and not undergoing medical tests first. However, Valentina was honored with the title Hero of the Soviet Union she received the Order of Lenin and the Gold Star Medal. She became a spokesperson for the Soviet Union, and while fulfilling this role, she received the United Nations Gold Medal of Peace. Valentina remains active in the space community, and her legacy is widely celebrated in everything from books to museums to stage productions. Valentina once said, if a woman can be a railroad worker in Russia, why can't they fly in space? Valentina is this week's Woman Crush Wednesday for the contribution she made to the space program. Well done, Valentina. Valentina Tereshkova